My name is Alicia. I am currently a junior and my major is popular music with a minor in Spanish. I'm excited for Friday. Day by day, the show just comes more and more together. It's definitely like a stressful process, but I think it's a good stressful. Now there's a part of me that likes the stress and the pressure and there's a part of me that's like, I'm just ready to relax, but I am very, very excited about the show. The cool thing about the 80 program is like when you join, it's like you kind of join the support group and there's so many uh, people around you that support what you do and that genuinely genuinely like what you do and um, I think that's probably the best part about ADP. Not only do you get experience and really find yourself as an artist and get to work with other people, but you have other people that support you and help you along the way and other people you get to get to support as well. It's really hard to put like one name for my sound because I, whenever I, I write something or I come up with something, I don't have like a particular set sound. I just kind of do it, whatever it is that I'm hearing in my head. And, but when I compare it to other things, I'll maybe say like a relaxed alternative R&B, kind of like very chill, very laid back, um, kind of smooth. Something, you know, not too like crazy or like, you know, nothing too crazy going on. Very chill. Yes, yeah, sometimes. Um, sometimes I will write a song that doesn't really reflect myself, but more so things that people need to be concerned about. But then often, and more so lately, I've been writing things that really just reflect my life and my uh, current situations. And I think there's always a message through music, even if it's about myself, there's always going to be someone else that's dealing with something similar or something, you know, worse. And I always think that hearing something like that is can help someone else. So yeah, I would say there's a message to my music. Well, really, I think that ADP is a platform to practice and to really get yourself together as an artist and to um, know what to do when you are ready to put yourself out there. So I think that ADP is kind of like your like your, your training wheels before you know you run off and do whatever it is that you want to do. But um, through ADP, you will find other opportunities and through those opportunities, you will find other opportunities. So I think that it, it's just to set you off and to start in the direction that you want to go. I think that's really the the role that ADP serves. Yes, you can find me on Facebook. My name is Alicia Rucker, um, and that's A-L-E-C-I-Y-A-R-U-C-K-E-R. -E -E and you can find me on Instagram, Alicia, all lowercase, A-L-E-C-I-Y-A. Hey, I'm TJ. I go by the name of Tommy Foma, and um, I'm a junior at Catawba College, double majoring in pop music and music business. Yeah, I'm ready for the show. ADP gave me like a really solid foundation to start, like building stuff on, you know, working on stage presence, um, how to gather a group of people in one place to practice and all that, making posters, promoting your own stuff, all of that, all of what goes into being an artist. I'm kind of transitioning right now. I used to do a lot of rap stuff, but I've been incorporating more pop, more surfy stuff into my music. So it's crazy. I tell my own stories, get my own perspective on things, and I hope people know that it's okay to like be themselves. You don't have to fit any kind of standard or anything. It's more like, where am I gonna take myself in the next few years? I feel like I've gained everything I can from ADP. You can find me on Instagram at you, me, and Tommy. It's Y-O-U-M-E-A-N-D-T-O-M-M-Y and SoundCloud.com slash Joey, J-O-E-Y, period. Yeah. It depends on how you do it. Like, unless you do, like, perfect form all the time, which oh, is not... Oh, well, for sure. Yeah. Oh, I know these people. Yeah. I really like my hair. Okay. Okay, that's smooth. Bro, this is a kid named Joey, bro. It's like... Oh, shit. 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 Oh, sh
That's why. They're not wearing all blue. You know. I'm from DJ. It was good. It was great. Awesome. Great show for the last one of the season. It was dope. It was an awesome show. I would definitely come see Tommy Fumbo and Alicia again. Heck yeah. It was really good. It was really awesome. Are you ready? I came in with Alicia and Tommy Fomo, aka TJ, I'm calling TJ. It has been nothing but magic since to see everybody grow and push themselves. See, TJ wasn't singing when he got here, and look at his vocals, can do all kinds of things now. I'm proud to know them. I'm proud to work with them like I have. They're inspiring. I'm inspired. It's bittersweet, but more sweet because we're done. And um, we have the outside gigs and shows to look forward to now, so it's like flying out of the nest almost. So, um, it's scary, but it's encouraging because we can't play no games from this, like, from this moment forward. It's like, done. Um, I feel relieved. I feel like I can relax a little bit, but the show went really well. I, I think I'm happy with it. Um, I feel pretty good. Um, there's always room for improvement, but overall it was a pretty good show.